Chuck. I don't have time for any of your nonsense. I have a very busy day planned. Blair, listen to me, please. I have this book. It's written in code, and I desperately need to crack it. I remembered how good you are at things like this. Or at least you were. Maybe that was the old you. You know what, Bass? Today is your lucky day. I needed a few minutes to get into character. If you want to think like Diana Payne, you have to become Diana Payne. Cheers. Thanks a lot. You're adorable. Spectator. Regardless of whether we find Jack, I can't tell you how glad I am at this moment that Diana isn't really my mother. Hand me the book. Well, it's not classic Caesar. I can tell that just from looking at it. What is that? This is my cipher slide. Don't you have one? There was a brief period in the third grade where I suspected my mother was reading my diary and measures had to be taken. But this is a visionaire code. It's not unbreakable, but it can take a long time, especially without software. We don't have a long time. Maybe she's something simpler for dates and times. Let me look at the calendar. Look, there. What? On the first Saturday of every month, at 9 p.m., there's an appointment made up of 14 or 15 letters. And they're each different, but if you crack those, you can get the rest. And look, this month's appointment is tonight. Pete was dating Diana during some of those Saturdays. Well, maybe we can jog his weed-addled mind into remembering something. It's worth a shot. Let's go. You look like you need a friend. He has a friend. Then why don't I show you the bedrooms? Both of you? Yeah, let's let's look around. Like the type that likes a royal theme. Not anymore. Perhaps we should extend our search to beyond just bedrooms. Uh, yes, any dark small space will do. Closet, attic, the wine cellar. We might not have time to see the whole house. The whole house? We'd love to, every room, even the occupied ones. She likes to watch. Nate's not answering. Probably already left with Lola. Have you seen Serena? Uh, no, I haven't. What's wrong? <sighs> uh, nothing. I'm sorry. You look like you just found out Jack Bass is your father. Chuck, can we just go, please? After everything we've been through, there's no room for secrets. Or should they be? Whatever it is, you can tell me, Blair. It's just us here, you and me. I think... Once everyone is gone... and it's quiet... you need to go back into that house. Have Arthur take you back to the city. Thank you.